Hey everyone, this is Daniel from HRD646 once again and welcome back to my video series on how to create a LinkedIn profile. In this video, I will review two of the more important sections of your profile, experience and education. Include as much information as possible. The experience section allows you to showcase your previous or current positions. Provide all of your work experience from start to current date with the most recent on top. It's very important to place the experience in chronological order for recruiters to view your career path. While editing each section, you are able to add the company name, your title, the dates you worked with the company, and a description of your job tasks and or accomplishments. Once you type in your company name, you'll notice that a logo auto-populates for companies recognized by LinkedIn. The title should be accurate to the position that you held. Don't embellish your title as this confuses employers and leaves them wondering what your job actually entailed. The dates of employment or years of experience are a factor in calculating your pay grade. There are different ways to format the description. You can use bullets to create an outline or use a paragraph format instead. The paragraph format minimizes the space used in the profile, making it easier to navigate. After clicking the Save button, review and edit the information and appearance to ensure quality. In the Education segment below, while editing, start off by typing in the name of your school. LinkedIn does provide a drop-down menu of schools to select from, and selecting one of the schools from this list auto-populates a logo as it did in the Experience section. Just under the name of the school, select the dates you attended the institution. For degree, type in the level of education that you are currently enrolled in or have obtained and provide your field of study in its respective slot. For the grade section, type in your GPA. In the activities section, type the names of the organizations you were a member of that may include but are not limited to honor societies, athletic teams, and other clubs. Under description, feel free to include your accomplishments while you are attending school. The education section allows you to post a link or upload a file to showcase some of your work. In order to add a link or upload a file, click on the square link here and you can include um, items, any projects that you may have worked on. Personally, once I'm done with this presentation, I will most likely be adding it to this section here by uploading the files or adding the links to connect to the different videos. All right, and that is all the time that we have for now. Thanks for joining me once again. This is Daniel from HRD 646 reminding you to seize the moment and enjoy.